joy to the world the lord is come and he is our sanctification he's the one who sets us apart to become more like him indeed sanctification is the will of god in christ jesus for us and so we celebrate his coming because he is our sanctifier and for this we give god praise honor and glory for jesus good morning and welcome to another morning devotion thank god for another day another opportunity where we can praise him and honor him because he is our sanctifier he's the one who sets us apart to become more like him 1 Corinthians 1 verse 30 says, And because of him you are in Christ Jesus, who became to us wisdom from God, righteousness and sanctification and redemption, the word of God to the people of God. In Christ, we have a position of sanctification. Our position in Christ by faith is true, regardless of our degree of spirituality. Hebrews 10.10 10 says, And by that will we have been sanctified through the offering of the body of Jesus Christ once for all. In Christ, we have progressive sanctification. Indeed, we are instantly sanctified by him and as we live and seek to be like him we are progressing to be sanctified and i like this we have also a future sanctification because we are not yet fully set apart we shall see christ and become like him jude 1 24 reminds us now to him who was able to keep you from stumbling that's jesus and present you blameless before the presence of his glory with great joy that's jesus to the only god our savior through jesus christ our lord be glory and majesty, dominion and authority before all times and now and forevermore. Amen. The word of God to the people of God. Jesus is our sanctification. He's the one who sets us apart to make us more like him. And today we celebrate, we give God praise because our sanctification has come and he is Jesus the Christ, the son of the living God. Father, we praise you as believers today that we are sanctified in you and we thank you for praying for us that we be sanctified and we thank you today that we can live holy and blameless according to your word. Thank you for what you have done. No one else can and will do. Only through Jesus the Christ we are set apart. We are made more like you. And we thank you for that today. As we live today, may we live sanctified. May we live holy, acceptable unto you. May we live in preparation to be more like you. So that we may be vessels of honor, sanctified and meek for your use and prepared for every good work. Thank you today for what you want us to do, what you called us to do, and we can only do it through your sanctifying power. And we give you praise. We celebrate. We rejoice today in that. We commend those who lead the nations this morning, even our prime minister and his family, and all of those who lead. We give them to you in prayer 
and praise this morning and we thank you because you can do it only you can make us whole make us holy make us blameless you can keep us from falling and present us faultless before the presence of your glory we thank you today that despite our challenges in Christ alone we can be sanctified. So we hide in you, we seek in you, we rest in you today, and we give you honor. We pray for the peace of Jerusalem and for families everywhere. We lift families today. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of Holy Spirit, we give you thanks. We pray, amen. God bless you today as we celebrate the fact that Jesus is our sanctification. He's the one who sets us apart in salvation and we honor you we honor you god for you alone is worthy to be praised have a great day in the lord amen